Okay, hey Violence, welcome to our first week of AMI Advanced slash Bonus uh, Music Studies. Um, we're going to be going through our more advanced scales uh, for this, starting with our A major. And I know this one we've done in class. We're going to be starting with this one, kind of working our way through uh, the rest of the sharps and then the, the flat key signatures, starting with a the easier of the the more advanced scales today with our A major. Um, you can see we've got three sharps just to remind you guys in A major we've got F sharp, C sharp, and then G sharp the one we don't see too often. Um, and here is our A major scale from start to finish. Um, as you can see kind of looking back A, B, C sharp. Remember, for C sharp, we've got to play high three. Normally, C is on the tape. We've got to kick our third finger out, or we're not on the tape. We're just past it, in between where C and then pinky D would be. It's gonna be our C sharp, D, E, F sharp, and then where our key signature gets a little weird with the G sharp. Again, high third finger, G sharp. Landing us on the first uh, A of our first octave here. Open A, B, C sharp, high two, D, open E, F sharp, G sharp. Normally we're used to playing G so as a low two, but since it's G sharp or high two, right? G sharp, A, right? So really this is really just a review for us. Um, so we shouldn't have too much trouble. Remember the thing that tends to get us is when we go back down, Going from A, G sharp, F sharp, E, D, C sharp, B, A. Here's where this likes to trick us. High three is easy to remember going up, not always so much coming down. So make sure when we play G sharp here on our D string, we've kicked our third finger up. So we're on G sharp, F sharp, E, D, C sharp, high three, right? B, A, really? Not much to it, just again, those high third fingers are what's going to be giving us the most trouble. So make sure, you know, we're in tune. A good way to check and make sure that you're in tune is first play your pinky note. Um, so I'm on my G string. I'm going to play my pinky D. Play it against my open D to make sure I'm in tune. And then if I put my third finger right up against that and take my pinky away, that's going to be a really, really good way to ensure that I'm playing it in tune. So uh, to practice this, let's play this through together with the metronome. I'm going to be playing it in half notes. Feel free to play along with me. And then from there, you can practice it on your own, trying to work it up to that uh, 80 clicks per uh, minute on quarter notes. Ready? One, two, three.